is I am playing three of this super combo. I only have one Krillin, and the reason why I'm playing three of this is because... What is up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joku DMD, and today I'm gonna teach you all about the drippiest leader in Dragon Ball, SS Son Goku, the fearless fighter, back from Yajirat. Look at that fit. Look at this man's fit. I don't know, like he looks actually wet on the card. If you look, you can see it looks like he's dripping, but this outfit is so good. Why would you not play a Goku in this outfit? It is, there's no reason to not do it. Also, I'm just gonna do a deck playthrough here, which is I've been doing, you guys know. Um, if you wanna see the deck profile, you can click the link in the description down there. You can go to DBS Deck Planet and check it out. Really the only thing that I think is worth talking about in terms of the list is I am playing three of this super combo. I only have one Krillin and the reason why I'm playing three of this is because, I mean, look at that. Would you, would you think Krillin looks better than that? Of course you wanna play the super combo. No, there actually is a reason why I'm playing it. It actually is better in some instances. This deck I kind of have built for the mirror match and not built for the mirror match. But anyway, I'll get into that. Um, if you're new here and you want to see more of this stuff, consider hitting that subscription button. It really helps me out. And if you're a returning member, let's check out this deck profile. Well, we're all going to check it out anyway. All right. So we got our six here. This hand's actually nasty also. I'm just going to keep this and we're going to set our life. So in your opening hand, you want to see the Gohan that searches. He's a really good turn one play. And if you see this card in your opening hand, you definitely want to keep this because you charge this. You charge this card. This is a pure intimidation tactic. It also turns on steadfast and repost. Uh, you know, repost is actually really bad in this mirror matchup, but it's a good card. And turning it on with this card is just really, really scary. So uh, first thing you want to do, pay one energy. I'm just going to pretend like we're going first. I didn't even roll. Search top five. You're going to grab a unison. Uh, you know, you want to see the Gohan. The Gohan's really good. Vegeta is also really, really good. So we'll just grab Vegeta. The rest of these go back to deck. So we'll pretend like we're going second so we can swing. So we'll go and we'll swing with our leader. When we swing with our leader, take a life, look up to the top five. Uh, and you play a unison in rest mode. I'm going to play TN in rest because I want to plus TN's gonna come out with a marker from your leader effect and you're just gonna plus on TN. And anybody that goes after your unisons, like they're really not doing much because you're just gonna replace them. You're just gonna replace them and keep going and you awaken at four. So, you know, it doesn't really matter. Anyway, so they're gonna go, they'll deal with damage. Um, then we'll go and draw a card, untap our energy and untap our leader, our very, very good looking leader, that is. Uh, here we're gonna charge something. We'll just charge a unison. You have so many unisons in your hand. You can plus on TN just to like freeze something basically is what he does. And then uh, you can swing with your leader. When you swing with your leader, you're going to take a life and look through top five. So these are top five. Vegeta is the one you want to play. Vegeta is going to come out in rest mode and uh, he's going to empower to uh, take carry these markers over and he'll just send Tien to the drop. When he comes into play, you get to KO something. So you will basically just say, you know, KO whatever four drop in rest mode. This deck mostly KO stuff in rest mode. So that's really how you're going to be doing it play him uh he's good because he lets you combo unisons from your hand so it makes your hand a little less dead and then you can actually just pay one and play another vegeta and when you play this vegeta when this one goes to the when this one goes into the dropper you draw a card he empowers carries those markers over you can plus one on him to give him uh, make him a 15k and then you can swing with him and then they're gonna go for their turn we'll say they uh, uh they swing into you here and you just freeze his army reinforcements by taking a life make a super shiny blocker token of course and then, you know, that's going to give you another ability to block another swing. Uh, so you get out of two swings and then, you know, if they do happen to swing again, maybe you take it uh, here and then we're going to go for our turn. So we'll draw a card and untap our energy, untap our dude. So here, once you awaken, you start playing unisons from hand. So you want to sequence this kind of properly. So I'm going to go ahead and charge uh, another one of these we may not play another one of these dudes one of those is you know enough on the field so the first thing we want to do is just uh you can plus with vegeta and if there's anything to swing at that's 10k you can swing at it with vegeta so you can actually have a pretty big play here um so off your gohan you can pay two energy and play your big gohan he's gonna empower oh, okay. three so he actually comes out with six markers on him and once you play him you can awaken untap an energy and draw a card and if you see an opening to 
kill them now like there's definitely a chance that you can because he's gonna ko three three cards in rest mode ignoring barrier and then if you minus three off him he's gonna give your leader a uh 25 uh, 5k boost and he's gonna be 25k triple attack so you can swing three times with him which is like kind of crazy if you see that opening thread to kill him you swing with your leader draw a card you can play oh yeah also when vegeta went to the drop we drew a card forgot to draw for that when you swing with him you draw a card and then you can play another unison from your hand so you know you can play like gohan who's gonna empower three again so or empower two again so he's gonna come out with three markers and he has blocker which is pretty nice you can plus on this dude go to four like if they don't have much to deal with this swing you can actually pay two untap your leader and give him double strike so Woo! he gets 10k and double strike and he has the 5k boost from before so now he's a 30k double strike which is pretty crazy so you just swing with him again he doesn't draw when you swing for the second time but he does uh you know draw that first time and then here you know same thing you can freeze his army reinforcements to make a blocker token deal with another one of their swings block one of their swings your unison can block one of their swings if they come out with a bomb that you think is going to kill you you can actually uh use this card it's insane it's basically always live my my teammate joe shout out joe if you're watching this he showed me this last night i didn't even think about this like this card is always alive and it doesn't negate the attack but it removes the card's skills so once you negate with this you know the card can't untap it can't it's actually really good in this matchup also against gohan it's just really really strong card you just like blank something and make it useless um and if they happen to deal that damage maybe they deal that damage and then um if you are need to combo out of something here this last swing you know they combo you can activate battle off this gohan discard one of these give your leader 5k and then you know minus two markers off here to give it another 10k so that's 15k combo power just by moving one card and a couple markers and it's really really strong and then for your turn you're gonna draw and here this is the big move this is also joe spice i gotta give gotta give props to joe joe spice so joe's got this awesome spice here where you know you play this unison you plus on your unison here put it to three and then you just slam this dude down japan this is, enemy. This is my enemy from realm of the gods i pulled so many of this dude and i'm so psyched that i can actually play him in a deck now because he comes out with seven markers dude's crazy this card is crazy crazy i'm just gonna put it at six and know that it's at seven because i don't want to grab another thing and also when this guy goes to the drop area you get to go through your deck and grab a trunks not that it really matters that much but you slide through here find that other trunks say trunks where are you we haven't seen any of our super combos either uh and trunks is in my hand so that's fine no trunks in here but when he goes yeah when he goes to the drop you get to grab a trunks but he must be in my it must be in my last life or something and then when this dude comes out like he's wild right you can minus four on this guy and when you minus four, you KO everything ignoring barrier. And then uh, you choose two cards and switch them to rest mode. So you can just like tap them out. And then he's gonna be a 40K double strike and he's dual attack. So you just swing with this dude twice for 40K double strike crazy and then of course you know you have your leader swing also you can draw a card and you probably won't replace this guy but you know combo whatever combo off him uh draw for that and blah blah blah. you get the idea anyway so that's kind of the deck i think this card is wild also super saiyan yamcha is amazing we didn't get to play him but super saiyan yamcha is some real spice he just he just helps filter your hand you know it it's a weird deck it's different because you want to you want to kind of sequence it in a different way so you can keep playing unisons but yeah you want to play you want to play it differently so you can sequence your turn so that you're optimizing your unison plays drawing as much as you can off your unisons and using your power effect as much as possible while resolving skills off your unison so the unisons actually do a lot in this deck the deck is pretty crazy it does a lot of things i think it's definitely worth picking up to try out also this man is just dripping look at him he's so shiny his drip is driptastic and he is the drip too so i hope you guys enjoyed this deck playthrough i really like playing this deck i hope you enjoyed playing it too uh, if you have any questions leave them in the comment section i'm a dentist i can't end without doing a dental tooth tip flossing is really important don't let anybody tell you otherwise you just get a listerine ultra clean flosser and you snap a new head on it once a day let it hang out with you in the evening and just floss the heck out of your teeth there's no reason to not do it because it's so easy in this day and age check out my reels on dental.dmd for more information on that thank you so much and i'll see you guys next time I have a deal for you guys today, basically. I'm going to try and teach you something. If you can come up and tell me what I taught you at the end of the time that I'm talking, you're going to get a pack of Pokemon cards. Does that sound cool? You guys like Pokemon cards? Yeah. Me too. I was, actually, I was actually right around your age when Pokemon cards came out. And guess what? I still like them. How crazy is that? So I brought some Pokemon cards. 
And basically, what's going to happen is you can come up to me at the end of me talking and tell me that there's a part of your tooth that's a crystal, and the crystal is called hydroxyapatite. I'm going to say that a bunch of times so you guys can remember it. But the easiest way to remember it is you know when you get really hungry, you have a big appetite? Yeah, you guys know that word? Yeah. Appetite? Yeah. If you just say hydroxy in front of that, hydroxy appetite, that's the name of the crystal in your teeth. It's also called enamel. You guys may have heard that word, enamel. Enamel is the outside of your teeth, but the correct scientific term for it is hydroxy appetite. 